an empty shell of a brand new community centre. Four walls and a roof on Hall Road, but nothing inside. And just a few days ago, it was feared that's how it would have to stay after talks to get Asda to fit it out fell apart. But now, after what some have described as an unprecedented U-turn, the supermarket chain has agreed to complete it and pay for the whole thing. For me, the key word that came back into the equation was community. It is a community centre and supermarkets are and should be part of the community. And I think a hardline commercial approach suddenly evaporated and Asda came back with the help of the council and it's lovely to have everybody back on board. So we can all have a nice relaxed Christmas now, can't we? Replacing the old Harford Community Centre on Peterkin Road with a new one was part of the deal when Asda was given permission to build its store on Hall Road back in 2013. But while the building's been finished, the chain has capped its budget for things like a kitchen and toilets to £70,000, less than half what the City Council estimated it would cost. And when the discussion deadline on Friday came and went without a deal, campaigners stepped up, creating a petition, planning a demonstration and even emailing the CEO of Asda's parent company, Walmart. It's great that the community got together and decided to take a little bit of action to push Asda into a position that they agreed to do exactly what they had said they were going to do over five years ago. So this is fantastic news for the community and this is what a community centre is, where the community gets together and joins together to force their way through to get it. Everybody is, is coming out of this feeling, uh, well I hope feeling good, uh, because Asda will have the, the goodwill of, of the local community uh, and the local community and the council working together have shown just how effective uh, community action can be. Now it's been agreed it should be finished in six months, though it's hoped it may be done sooner with an opening around Easter. And much like the community who've been waiting for it, a spokesperson for Asda now says they're looking forward to opening the new centre in the coming months. Lauren Hewitt, Mustard TV, Lakenham.